Okay, here I am at the lathe. I've got a piece of ebonite in. This is about an inch and a half long. I'm going to make a long section. Uh, this is my nib that I have here, and I have it marked. Uh, this is about 11 16 down from where the threads start to just be on that chrome ring like that. And what I'm shooting for is is this right here and then I'm going to come back and then re-drill 11 30 seconds on top of that 17 64th. Now I don't have a center hole but I did face it with a skew. I've got a little bit of a dip and I've got a brad point. I'm using brad point bits so uh, that should line up nicely. So I've got the speed turned down slow. Okay, I've switched to 11 30 seconds and I've got just a really light mark right there you can barely see. But we'll go ahead and drill that in. Okay, according to the diagram, I've got this first part here drilled, which is 1 16th inch deep, 11 30 seconds. I've got the main body here, 11 64 now I need to drill the small threaded section and I'm going to use a 15 64 drill bit for that and that is for the threaded uh, bottom of this nib and then I need to go down it looks like about a quarter of an inch so I'm going to mark that once I get to the bottom So I need to go a quarter of an inch from here, so to there. You know, I should just drill that all the way through. I don't know what I'm thinking. And I'll clean it off the other side. is a homemade tap using a quarter inch bolt uh, tapped with an M7 by 75 thread. Make sure that's tight. And that should fit in there. And you can 
and see how that looks. So I'll just have to face a little bit of that down, but the otherwise that looks good. So we'll just need to clean up the other side of that. Oops. Okay, now for the back side, I've got a 9 30 seconds is what I'm using in for this right here. Um, so that's what I have in the chuck. That's going to go on the back side. My section is going to be an inch long. This little gap from here to here is this threaded section. So I'm going to only drill to that first line. So that's the line I have marked. I'm going to take a ink. You can kind of see that in there. That should just fit and snap right in. And I can feel that snap right in just fine. Okay, that put a half inch tenon on there to thread. Put a little mineral oil. This is a homemade die holder. I'm doing a half inch by 28 thread. Whoops, turning on me a little bit. Okay, so now we'll just cut the other section. Okay, I've got a piece of threaded ebonite. This is the half inch by 28. This is the half inch by 28. And then put this back in the four jaw chuck. See, this just threads right in there. So we're just going to shape that down. I'm going to take a little bit off the front of there also. shape of the section. I'm going to unscrew that. I just put a, a little bit of um, hut crystal coat on that. I've never finished an ebonite before so that's interesting looking. So we'll go ahead and screw that part in. That nib. And this would go in on the back side. Okay, so there's your section. All right. So 
So this is the section that I just made. I cut it in half. I actually sanded it in half on the disander. Now there it is right there with the section and the and the ink put together. So that actually goes together quite nicely. Thank you for watching. Subscribe. Give me a thumbs up or like.